For years, the high-resolution landscape has been a quiet battleground. Nikon, with a Z7 II, established a foundation of pure image quality. But the world moves fast. Competitors have pushed the boundaries of autofocus and video features. The question has lingered, what is Nikon's answer? When will they unleash the true successor to the high megapixel throne? The silence is finally broken. The leaks are emerging, not from casual rumors, but from patents and deep industry sources. They confirm that Nikon is not just refreshing a camera. They are building a high-resolution monster that borrows the absolute best technology from their flagship Z8 and Z9 models. Welcome to my channel tech launch. Subscribe my channel and click on the bell icon for the new tech updates. But places it into the hands of the dedicated landscape, portrait, and studio professional. This is the Nikon Z7 III, a camera rumored to shatter the expectations of dynamic range, resolution, and, finally, hybrid performance. If you demand the absolute best detail for your prints, your portfolio, or your client work, this 30 minutes will determine your next gear purchase. The Megapixel Monster Sensor and Dynamic Range The core of the Z7 III is the sensor, and the whispers here are deafening. Forget the 45 megapixels of the Z7 II. The Z7 III is rumored to feature an all-new BSI CMOS sensor, likely landing between 61 and 67 megapixels. This isn't just about a bigger number. This is about challenging medium format in a 35 mm body. The leaks suggest Nikon's priority with this sensor is dynamic range and color depth, prioritizing image quality over the raw speed of the Z8 slash Z9 stack sensor. Imagine pulling an impossible amount of detail from deep shadows without introducing noticeable noise. This is the holy grail for landscape photographers shooting at base ISO. Furthermore, industry patents hint at a revolutionary enhanced sensor cooling mechanism. Why? Because a higher resolution sensor generates more heat. Nikon is rumored to have designed a passive cooling system that allows this high MP sensor to run cleaner and cooler, which directly translates to superior image fidelity and less noise, especially in long exposures or high ISO studio work. If Nikon can deliver the dynamic range of the Z7 II with the resolution of its competitors, it reclaims the title for ultimate image quality. Speed and Intelligence X7 and Autofocus The Z7 II's biggest bottleneck was speed, particularly its autofocus and buffer capacity. The Z7 III is rumored to smash this bottleneck by integrating the colossal power of the X7 processor, borrowed directly from the Z8 and Z9. What does this mean for the high-resolution shooter? AI-driven autofocus. The Z7 III will finally gain the industry-leading AI deep learning subject detection features. Eyes. Animals. Birds. Vehicles. This brings the high-resolution camera up to par with its competition, ensuring that even a fast-paced portrait or a fleeting wildlife moment is captured with flawless focus, leveraging hundreds of AF points. Unprecedented buffer. The X7 will enable continuous shooting speeds of up to 14 or even 20 frames per second in compressed RAW format. This is critical. You get the speed for burst shooting complex scenes without sacrificing the 61 megapixel resolution, turning the Z7 III into a viable option for weddings, events, and commercial work that demands both speed and detail.